Hey everyone, welcome back to Boater Plays Something. Today we're playing Descent Free Space, a space sim from 1998. We're back on the Galatea, our home ship, uh, and everything's laid out nice and familiar. If you're interested in learning more about the game, how I'm playing it, uh, then you can catch me up in the tech room after the mission. I'll be out of uniform and just generally babbling on about one of my favorite games of all time. If you want to watch the entire playlist of Boater Plays Something Descent Free Space, then that man up there at the information desk will be able to give you a hand. He'll give you the link to the entire playlist so you can watch from the start. Otherwise, if you're ready to go, grab your flight suit, set into the briefing room, and let's play something. Good morning, pilots. I'm going to get right to it. Everyone, welcome back. Forces are sprouting up everywhere, and it's no secret that our front lines are taking a meeting. Cutscene command briefing. As you probably know, no one has been able to communicate with them, and Terran intelligence has no leads on their origins or their motives. On the upside, their shielding technology seems to be working just fine for us. By this afternoon, all fighters stationed on the Galatea will have been fitted with them. Try to keep them intact, all right? The cruiser Tyrannus is suspected Do to be my the best. best man for the Sheevans in this sector. It's here in the IKEA system, and we suspect it's low on fighters and supplies due to its recent attack runs. We have reason to believe it will soon jump to another system to resupply. We don't know where it will jump to, but there is only one subspace known out of IKEA, and we intend to blockade it. Therefore, that's in probably where it's jumping more to. more about the slippery bastards, we're going to attempt something bold: the capture of the Tyrannus. If this goes off, it will give us an opportunity to study Sheevan technology up close and bag a few live Sheevans in the process. In order to do this, we will conduct a series of missions designed to take out the cruiser's escorts and defenses. Time to chip away at the boulder, people. That is all. Report to your flight leaders for your orders. Dismissed. Sweet. Oh, Special and still more command briefing. Mm, that's a pretty cutscene. It is time to finish the job. To this end, Terran Command has sent a full wing of Athena bombers equipped with a newly developed stiletto bomb. But I still haven't been able to use the interceptor bomb. Still, I'll watch the dogfight here. Heroic Delta and Epsilon wings taking out Tyrannus escort. The Athena is our most maneuverable bomber. It carries a massive payload, yet in dogfights, is nearly as effective as a fighter. Nearly. Translation, not quite. The stiletto bomb has now been thoroughly tested back in Seoul, and is now ready for use. It can be used to destroy subsystems on any ship, Ooh. which prove more effective than the disruptor. Okay, I'm a fan. The electronic seeking device I don't have to pinpoint the little thing, just be like, oh look, it's right there. Stiletto homing capabilities are limited, so make sure you get a clean shot before you launch. The stiletto should be especially useful in destroying the Tyrannus' engines and weapon systems. All Athena bombers will be equipped with stilettos and will be piloted by Alpha Wing. Alright, mission briefing. The Kane class cruiser Tyrannus has begun its counterattack. Although we destroyed most of its fighter escort, it managed to call in a repair craft. It is now nearly fully functional. Who slipped on that one? Long range sensors indicate that only two fighters and three bombers remain to protect the Tyrannus. That's a little uncomfortably the exact. The Tyrannus is heading for the Beta Cygni subspace node, where we expect it to mount an offensive. This only allows a small window in which to conduct a preemptive strike. Your primary objective is to disable and disarm the Tyrannus in order to enable its capture. This will be our first attempt to capture a major Sheevan vessel. Three wings will be assigned to this task. Alpha Wing will be flying Athena bombers. These bombers just arrived on the Galatea and are And have a fresh coat of paint, try not to scratch them. The stiletto is capable of destroying subsystems in one hit. Alpha's primary responsibility will be to disable one hit. And disable the terrain. <laughs> okay. Beta Wing is assigned to escort Alpha and protect it from fighter attacks. Beta will fly Apollo class fighters. So it's probably best if I'm not micromanaging Beta and Gamma Wing. Gamma Wing will fly Valkyries and should engage any hostile fighters and bombers in the area. If needed elsewhere, they can be assigned to any task that you see fit. I might not even be able to give orders to Beta, but we'll see. Once the Tyrannus has been disarmed and disabled, Omega transports will arrive and capture it. When the Tyrannus has been captured, you are to return to the Galatea for debriefing. Do not allow the Tyrannus to escape or be destroyed. Good luck. 
Okay. Weapon loadout. We don't have, still don't have those interceptors yet. <laughs> the Athena is downright incapable of holding the standard issue weapons. Um, you've got a mix. I don't know why you'd need dumb fire. What is this? Why do you have ML16s on there? You got disruptor, you got disruptor. I'm giving you guys a couple more Avengers just because we've got them. Um, everyone's getting heat seekers. There shouldn't be any reason that we can't lock on. If there is, I'll be coming back here and changing loadout after I've died. Just saying. Um, and they can use Dumpfire all they want, but I'm giving myself plenty of disabling power. Let's do this. Okay, Alpha, start the disarming process. I, meanwhile, will be working on engine disabling. That constant boom, 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 boom that you hear means that one of them's trying to get an, a, uh, a lock on me with an aspect seeking missile. It already took a hit, jeez. Oh jeez. See if that thing helps against the. Disabling subsystems with one hit, huh? Oh, jeez. Yeah, actually, that took a decent chunk out of the engines. Let's flip around. Toss that last one off. to target individual turrets and I don't know what it is. Oh. And how about with this stuff until we get uh, Omega in here to start capturing. Okay, give me just a moment here. I want to know how to target weapons. Um, targeting, targeting. Uh, da, 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 next subsystem. Target, target, target next live turret. K. K. Um, am I using this for anything? Uh, yeah, that's not a thing that I'm going to really be using. So, cancel that, we go back to targeting. And clear the conflict, and off we go. Okay! That's on the other side of the ship. That's a missile launcher that's causing a lot of those cluster bombs to be tossed at us, and I'd rather it not. Oh, 
Oh, whoops. Unsuccessful. Omega 2, give it a shot. Omega 2, give it a shot. Yeah. You get it. Up. Oh. New bandits in the area. Oh, lots of new bandits. Sheevan Wing Rama is attacking the Tyrannus. Stop them. Um, if you guys would get out of the way. Uh no, I don't care about them, I care about Rama. Yeah. Good job, team. What was this? This was Omega One on its sad and lonely retreat. <sighs> Derp. Ah, crap. Let's toss off one of those, even though it's really not supposed to do anything to you guys. So why aren't you still attached? You can just go wee. Unless you've got a friggin' tow cable on that thing. Oh, just that, that Sheevan cruiser. No problem. The way he says it is that like, he has no idea what he was sent here to do, and then it's like, oh yeah, that, that cruiser. Uh, need some help. Would help if you got out and pushed. And that's what you're here to do, is to push.
What did I just hear? I hope that was support warping in. Oh, Jesus. Good, they're coming after us and not the Tyrannus. That was Beta 2, right? That was Beta 2. Ryan. Coming a little too fast for just the four guys we've got left. Which I might add, all four are in bombers. Ah! Um, you don't have time. I'm gonna put that really simple. Time is something you haven't got. Good. I want to see what the hell it looks like with you carrying that thing, but quite frankly, I'm a little busy. Still a little distance away, so I'm gonna be able to get to see what you look like. Uh. Yeah, okay, that's suitably dopey. This is why I stayed here. Well, that's good times. Because I shot the stiletto at it. Oh, Jesus. Should have just let it sit and rot there. Okay, what did you just destroy? You're heading off on some damn fool errand, aren't you? Yeah, you are. Stay with the Tyrannus, make sure it doesn't get hit. Next time I disable something, I'll just leave it alone until I can kill other stuff. It's not like it can repair itself. Alpha 2 is down.
fighter craft are heading away from us. Oh my god, guys, you are in the node. Just go. Time to waypoint 12 seconds, just go. That is a ridiculously big cruiser. is ignoring us. I am out. <sighs> Congratulations, Alpha One. You were instrumental in the first capture of a major Shivan vessel. The Halkins is taking her to the Tomba station, where engineers will be able to study their technology and learn more about their methods and motives. Meanwhile, feel free to relax for a few days. You deserve it. Yeah, it'd be nice. In recognition of your continuing service to the GTA, you have been awarded the Medal of Good Conduct. Maybe give me some good stuff to shoot in the future. Good conduct. Very nice. Recommendations. None. Okay, guys, that was a uh, probably our first big mission. There have been other missions, there have been other important missions, but that was the first one that just felt exhausting after just one mission. Uh, a lot going on there, and uh, a lot of fun. I feel like we're now solidly into the second act of the game. Um, if you're enjoying the game, remember that you can uh, view the entire playlist. Link is at the beginning of the video as well as in the description below. Uh, you can subscribe to me for more updates or follow me on Facebook and Twitter slash BoaterBug. You can support me on Patreon.com slash BoaterBug, uh, just so I can keep making these things. Um, uh, I hope you guys are enjoying this, and I will see you guys next episode. Have a good one.